Hi guys. Um, I don't know what day it is. It's Wednesday, November. I can't see without my glasses. November 14th. Um, and I love to just talk about tender moments and letting go. Um, I just had such a beautiful moment with uh, the person that comes to clean for us. She came over to me and every week, every other week she comes and she is always saying how much she loves me and um, we hug. And today she just came and I was laying on the couch and she just like stroked my hair and told me how much she loved me and that I'll feel better soon. And it's from at times the most amazing people that you kind of take for granted. They just come and do their job and they leave. Or they're more of an acquaintance to you. But they're the kind of sweetest souls. And when you're not well, you feel it so deeply. Because it's just like such a gentleness to it. So that was just beautiful. And it's these people that you'll never forget. And letting go, I recently had to let go of my last client uh, who I did the major renovation for of his a couple different rooms in his house. And um, that was very difficult, but necessary. And I kept having some dreams about it recently because it just happened. As I realized that the mind has to process this information because it's new. You know, you have to again adjust to a loss so I worked for him for many years, and I deeply cared about him. I loved him. Um, but I realized that I have to move on. I have to uh, care about myself. And um, I want to attract um, other great things in my life. Um, but I've realized I've had to let go, if you will, of so many different things since this happened on July 19th, where my world changed. Um, I've just realized that many times you have to let go of people that just, it just doesn't work out for you and them anymore. You've had your time with them. And that's great, but it's okay to move on as well because you have other opportunities that are going to, um, and people that are going to enter your life because you're on a different plane now. And um, it's kind of like a new slate. And 
you can write on that slate whatever you want. And that's what I'm preparing to do. And um, I also today, you know, because my illness has so many different symptoms to it, every day there's something different popping up as I have this thing on my eye now that I finally reached and called my uh, primary care, and I have some ointment now for it. Um, I thought I could get rid of it myself, clearly not. Um, but I realized today I just reflected for a brief moment on all that I went through, and I literally found myself feeling nauseous for a second at that memory because it's so shocking, I guess, to me that, you know, I have been so ill since July 19th. I mean, clearly I was ill before that, but I didn't understand uh, until that day how badly I was ill. Um, but I think... Uh, I'll go to another video because I think you're only allowed a certain amount of time on YouTube. So I'll pause and go to another one.